I'm Ariana Kaiser, and you're watching Week Bite. The FAA reported on Thursday that a 61-year-old Continental Airlines pilot died mid-flight between Belgium and New Jersey. Crew guided the plane to a safe landing in Newark, where the deceased pilot remarked, I, I thought hell would be warmer. In Japan, Oscar winner Halle Berry is known as Oscar in a hairy belly. A study in U.S. News & World Report shows many U.S. employers are now asking job seekers to submit to psychological evaluations that can include multiple choice tests and workplace simulations using paid actors, many of them former cast members of Eight is Enough. No word yet on when the U.S. Post Office is going to require similar psychological testing. Hint, hint. In entertainment, the taking of Pelham 123 opened last weekend, about 35 years ago. Nestle announced it has issued a recall on its refrigerated products containing Toll House cookie dough after reports that consumers who had eaten the dough were developing E. coli related illnesses. A spokesperson assured the public that the company stands behind its product, stating, The key ingredient to Nestle's Toll House cookies is still love. It just turns out that another ingredient happens to be trace amounts of fecal matter. President Barack Obama's first Supreme Court nominee, Sonia Sotomayor, continues to undergo so-called murder boards, simulated confirmation hearings designed to prepare her for the actual hearings coming up in July. News of this proved embarrassing for former President George W. Bush, who believed the murder board was the nail-studded 2 by 4 that Dick Cheney kept behind the chair in his office. That's it for now. We'll see you next time on Week Bite.